Daily Words of God For some people, no matter what issue they might encounter when performing their duties, they do not seek the truth, and they always act according to their own thoughts, notions, imaginings, and desires. They are constantly satisfying their own selfish desires, and their corrupt dispositions are always in control over their actions. Though they may complete the duties to which they have been assigned, they do not gain any truth. So what are such people relying on when performing their duties? They are relying neither on the truth nor on God. That bit of truth that they do understand has not taken up sovereignty in their hearts. They are relying on their own gifts and abilities, on whatever knowledge that they have acquired, and on their talents, as well as on their own willpower or good intentions to complete these duties. This is a different sort of nature, is it not? Though you may sometimes rely on your naturalness imagination, notions, knowledge, and learning to fulfill your duty. No issues of principle emerge in some of the things you do. On the surface, it looks as though you have not taken the wrong path. But there is one thing that cannot be overlooked. During the process of performing your duty, if your notions, imaginings, and personal desires never change and are never replaced with the truth. And if your actions and deeds are never done in accordance with the principles of the truth, then what will the final outcome be? You will become a service doer. This is precisely what was written in the Bible. Many will say to me in that day, Lord, Lord, have we not prophesied in your name? And in your name have cast out devils, and in your name done many wonderful works. And then will I profess to them, I never knew you. Depart from me, you that work iniquity. Why does God call these people who exert effort and who render service, you that work iniquity? There is one point we can be sure on, and that is that no matter what duties or work these people do, their motivations, impetus, intentions, and thoughts arise entirely from their selfish desires, are totally based on their own ideas and personal interests, and their considerations and plans completely revolve around their reputation status, vanity, and future prospects. Deep down, they possess no truth, nor do they act in accordance with the principles of the truth. Thus, what is crucial for you to seek now? We should seek the truth and perform our duties in accordance with God's will and requirements. What specifically should you do when performing your duties in accordance with God's requirements. With regard to your intentions and ideas when doing something, you must learn how to discern whether or not they accord with the truth, as well as whether your intentions and ideas are geared toward fulfilling your own selfish desires or the interests of God's house. If your intentions and ideas accord with the truth, then you can do your duty in line with your thinking. However, if they do not accord with the truth, then you must quickly turn around and abandon that path. That path is not right, and you cannot practice that way. If you continue to walk that path, then you will end up committing evil.